Good morning everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you a little morning routine. I just woke up, I'm trying to wake up more <laughs> and then I'm gonna get started with my day. First thing I'm going to do is <coughs> cough apparently <laughs> no first thing i'm gonna do is change into other clothes because i'm currently not wearing pants and i'm not really trying to film this without pants on and also i have partnered with bioclarity for this video so thank you so much to them for sponsoring this okay this lighting is horrendous <laughs> but first thing i need to do is make my bed this is one of the things that makes me feel a lot more productive and my room is a little bit messy right now but once i make my bed I feel a lot better about it. <laughs> okay, much better. Okay guys, so I'm going to show you what I've been doing for my morning skincare routine. It's gotten really important to me to take care of my skin and use non-toxic products. So I recently got these three steps from BioClarity and I'm really, really excited to show you guys how I've been using them. First thing is I'm just gonna put my hair up for obvious reasons, I don't want it getting all wet. <laughs> I love that BioClarity is non-toxic and plant-based because our skin literally soaks up everything that we put on it. So I wanna make sure I'm using good, reliable products. So BioClarity has three steps. There is cleanse, zen, and hydrate. So I'm gonna show you guys how I've been using these. First step is cleanse. I'm just going to wet my face and then rub a little bit of this in. And once I have it all rubbed in, I'm just going to rinse it off with some warm water and pat it dry. Okay, so the next step is probably my favorite one. It's super fun. It's basically the Zen step. I really like it because it's actually a little dropper and you get to like drip it on your face, which is really fun. And it's actually this bright green color because BioClarity uses a type of chlorophyll called Floralux in their products and it's really calming, it makes my skin less irritated, and overall just feel really good and healthy. Okay, so I'm just gonna like push down the dropper to make sure there's some in there and then literally just drop it on my face it's so much fun <laughs> Boop. and then I just kind of rub it into my skin okay the final step is the moisturizer so I'm gonna put this on all this together has really just made my skin feel a lot softer and less irritated especially I've been so stressed with school and everything and finals that this just like really makes my skin chill out <laughs> which is definitely must must much needed i love doing this in the morning because it seriously makes me feel so refreshed and more awake and there's no better feeling than having nice clean skin to start the day with you guys should definitely check out bioclarity you guys could be saving up to 40 percent off a skincare routine and i also have a code for you guys Sorry, my voice is like <laughs> been iffy all week, but I also have a code. If you guys use the code Tasha, you can get an additional 15% off. So just check out the link in the description and you can see everything from there. Okay, so my next step is to make myself a coffee. I'm using my cute little koala mug. Guys, I wanna go to Australia and hold a koala <laughs> so badly, but this is the coffee I'm currently using. It's just the Pete's Little Pods. Hopefully you can see that. I'm really not picky about the pods that I use, kind of whatever's on sale or whatever looks good at the time, but I'm just gonna plop this in. And I usually do the middle setting. I'm kind of in the mood to drink it black today, so that's what I'm gonna do. And in case you guys are wondering, this little mug is from Forever 21. I love it. I have like a mug obsession. <laughs> so most mornings, I actually usually only have coffee for breakfast, which I know might not seem like the healthiest option, but the only reason I do that is because lunch at my sorority, at least while school's in session, is at 11.30, so it's pretty early, and sometimes I sleep in a little late, so I kind of just drink my coffee and then wait until lunchtime to eat. After I drink my coffee, I usually get ready 
and do my makeup for the day so I'm about to do that I feel like you guys don't really want to see it I have a lot of videos of me doing my makeup and I know I'm gonna be doing a get ready with me soon so stay tuned for that I will typically do my makeup for the day also I went outside and it's kind of cold so I might be changing out of my shorts and into something a little bit warmer I always like to listen to a podcast when I'm doing my makeup and this one is my favorite. If you guys like true crime, you should definitely check out Crime Junkie. And they post new episodes on Mondays, and today's a Monday, so it's perfect. <laughs> so I'm going to play this one and do my makeup now. Okay, so I just finished putting my makeup on. I put these really cute clips in my hair. They're actually from Amazon, and I got a pack of three for only like $7. So I'll link them down below because I think they're really cute. And I'll try to link my outfit down below as well if possible. Now is the time for me to print and ship some Poshmark orders. Obviously, I don't do this every day, but I do sell stuff pretty frequently, and I try to get things out as soon as possible. So I'm going to print now, and then I always walk the stuff to the campus post office and drop them off there. This is actually what the third clip looks like, in case you guys are wondering, but I have this all packed up. If you guys are interested in anything that I sell, I'm always listing things on Poshmark, so I'll link my little profile down below, but I'm about to bring this to the post office. Okay, so I am headed over to the post office now. I have headphones in because I normally finish listening up, listening? I normally finish up listening to whatever podcast I started as I'm walking to campus. But if you guys have any recommendations for podcasts, let me know. I do like true crime a lot, but I'm open to other podcasts, so let me know. I currently listen to Crime Junkie, and there's a person walking by me. I feel awkward. But I typically listen to Crime Junkie and then My Favorite Murder, so definitely leave me some more recs. Campus currently looks like this because they're setting up for commencement in a few days, but Right over there is normally where I drop my packages. So I'm headed over now. But yeah, people are studying. People are getting ready to graduate. Good times. More graduation setup. Just grabbed my cap and gown, which feels pretty weird, <laughs> but I'm excited. Commencement setup part three. It's literally the whole campus. It's just commencement stuff. So I just came back from campus and dropping off the package, getting my cap and gown, and I came home, you can't even see it, to this super cute PR package, so I'm gonna show you guys. Okay, so this is the brand that it's by. I don't know how to pronounce it, to be honest, but it looks like this is their product for blondes, specifically cool tone blondes, so I think this is so funny. I don't know what I'm gonna do with all these balls. Drowning in balls up in here. Is it one product in here? <laughs> okay, well, this is the product. I just think it's funny that now I have all of these stress balls. So because I am titling this a healthy morning routine, I know it would make sense for me to go work out, but I genuinely work out at night. <laughs> so I'm probably gonna be working out tonight. And if so, I will insert the clip of that occurring here. Okay guys, hello. I just got out of my last late night class. I do have one final tomorrow, but I am in fact going to the gym. I'm finishing out this, <laughs> this day strong. I'm also trying to hide this massive pile of crap behind me, but yeah, this is what I'm wearing to the gym, some Lululemon. My gym membership at the USC gym is only through like the end of finals, I think, so I need to either pay for that for the summer or find a gym to go to. So if you guys live in LA and have any gym recommendations that aren't super expensive, like I don't think I can justify paying for Equinox, <laughs> but if you guys recommend any other gyms, please let me know. Okay guys, so basically I was working out for like 18 minutes maybe and all of a sudden all the lights turned off <laughs> and I guess they have shortened hours for finals week because they closed at 9 so I could only do half of my workout and everyone was just like standing on their machines like in the pitch black and we were all so confused but 
yeah, at least I tried, you know? Yeah, so that's basically what I've been doing most mornings during the school year. This might change up a little bit once I'm graduated, but sorry if this video was a little short. I kind of sleep in, so my mornings are a little short, but I love you guys. And once again, thank you to BioClarity for partnering with me for this video. Stay tuned for more videos. Okay, bye guys.